first thing crew out here, uh, 17 Marines and, and one corpsman. Uh, we're out here supporting the German Air Force uh, here at Exercise Mountain Roundup. So our role in the, in the exercise is as JTACs uh, here on the ground controlling all the CAS platforms uh, throughout the training days. So whenever we're not doing that, we're doing internal training in preparation for an upcoming deployment on the 11th Mew. Training area is fantastic for decentralized operations. So what we're doing is we're pushing out our four-man firepower control teams uh, to various locations within the within the impact areas uh, where they can do their dynamic casts uh, and individual training efforts while as a headquarters element we're back here kind of tracking their battle movements and deconflicting um, true and notional fires. So uh, there'll be times where we'll actually have live hornets coming off the aircraft um, just validating their final attack headings and it's deconflicted from friendly forces on the ground and additionally we have some notional indirect fire assets uh, that we're kind of placing throughout the battle space to add some complexity. And the whole matter out here is how does Anglico fit into the big piece, you know, in a real world scenario uh, like Afghanistan, um, you know, the past wars in, in Iraq uh, and current operations around the world. And the answer is simply uh, Anglico is the liaison arm of the Marine Corps, whereas we enhance the, battle, the that MAGTAF commander's uh, ability to influence the battle space. We double his, uh, his ability.